It's being seen as a victory for common sense. An application to relocate the grave of the Dambusters' dog has been turned down by councillors. The black Labrador, which belonged to the pilot Guy Gibson, is buried at RAF Scampton. The Royal Air Force wanted to move it because asylum seekers are due to be housed at the site. Those against the plan say it is a piece of history that should stay where it is. Leanne Brown has the story. To take that dog away would be an absolute disgrace and I am absolutely over the moon. Common sense prevail and, and so it should. We're not going to be walked over. The grave isn't going to be walked over. Reaction following last night's planning meeting, where an application to relocate the grave of Guy Gibson's dog was refused. Hello, boy. What are you doing? As depicted in this film, the Black Labrador was an integral part of life at RAF Scampton. No, not near, old boy. Go on. He died on the same day 617 Squadron took to the skies for the Dambusters raids. Come on, boy. Gibson was devastated and he asked Flight Sergeant Powell, Chiefy Powell, if he would bury him at midnight. Gibson uh, later wrote in his own book that he thought that uh, it might well be uh, that the dog was going into the ground at the same time that he might have been going into the ground. The grave has remained ever since and locals say it's an important part of history. The dog's grave is the sole remaining artefact on the station and it's hugely important that that's protected. If we allow the Home Office plan to go ahead or things like the grave to be moved, then their stories will fade into history and all those sacrifices and service will be uh, for nothing really, they'll be lost. If it stays here and the RF says, well, we can't care for it, we have plenty of volunteers and plenty of people that will go around and look after it because it is important to us. There was applause for Sir Edward Lee, who spoke about the wider battle of preventing asylum seekers from being housed at the site. What is important about this site is the history, and the RAF Scampton is to the RAF what Portsmouth is to the Royal Navy, and the grave of the dog, Guy Gibson's office, the hangars, they're all going to be part of a world-class heritage centre if we can see off this absurd proposal to have 2,000 migrants cooped up here. The RAF says it deeply values the heritage of the site and will continue to ensure it's preserved appropriately and respectfully for future generations. Leanne Brown, BBC Look North, Lincoln. So much interest in that, that story, and I know uh, I could tell by the uh, number of people at the meeting, a lot of people were relieved that it went that uh, way at the meeting uh, last night in uh, Scampton. And, of course, the uh, main story we will continue to uh, follow on the uh, programme.